Yeah. Leo wanted to talk about this Will Smith thing. Yeah. I, the reason I don't want to talk about it is because I'm 95% sure it was staged and it's lame ass mainstream Hollywood doing whatever they can do to right. bring attention to their dying industry. That's yeah. what I think's going on. But can we pull it up, Austin? We'll watch it and debate here. Dude, yeah. Crazy. What do you say? What do you say, King? I heard a Mudflap had a great conspiracy theory about it. You know, I'm still questioning it. But just to say, like, I say fucked up shit too, right? Personally, I feel like if you're going to slap Chris Rock, why not slap Jada? She's the one who, you know. She man, fucked I'm, other I'm, guys. I'm, and yeah, yeah. I'm, no, I'm, domestic violence is bad. I'm just, uh. you know. But it's not funny, you know. It's fucked up. Chris Rock's a good. Yeah, what you slapping Chris Rock for? Chris Rock didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> Get your hands on your bitch. <laughs> Trying to do some Chris Rock right now. I got to be careful because whenever you're doing Chris exactly Rock, it's right. there. You, he, he might slip in some words that aren't polite to say. Yeah, dude. Chris Rock uh, seemed too shy. I think they did what the reality, the reality show shit, which they tell one half of the team. Like, like if they're going to do this bit, they only tell Will Smith to do it and they let the Chris Rock's reaction be raw. I don't think that's the case. You think they both were in on it? Because that, that stunt, I don't think he was able to pull that off on one take. I don't I, think he could do that. Was He he let him hit him. I I, I, I don't know hard. any man who would let another man in their personal space like that without flinching at all. I mean, let's watch it right now. It seems to me like he thought Will Smith was going to say something. Danny, you don't, you don't think he might have been a little bit of, you know, he's just like, there's like 10 million people watching this, so he's probably just like, uh, you know, a little bit in that uh, state of flow, you know what I mean? So he can't like... You know who's got the hardest him. job tonight? Javier Bardem and his wife are both nominated. Now, if she loses... He can't win. He can't win. <laughs> Chris he Rock's the man. He's really good. He's Will just a Smith good fucking wins. comedian. Like, He's the man. Lord. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? <laughs> see, press pause right so here. So he's laughing. So It was funny. So he laughs right there. Also, if this was a real raw moment... Mm -hmm. I feel like the joke that provoked it would have been less sterile. Mm -hmm. I mean, that is the that's a perfect example of a joke that some Hollywood producers like, yeah, we're going to set up the big slap moment with this edgy jab about her hair. Woo. Mm -hmm. if, if it was really a raw moment, it would have been like, man, that bitch Jada Smith. She'd be fucking rappers all over town. Right. Yeah. Like, that's what would have de deserved a slap. Yeah, yeah, Don't you yeah, think yeah. Don Rickles would have mentioned that? I think Don Rickles would have asked. Probably. Done that, dude, yeah. I just, I recently rewatched a Don Rickles special that he shot when he was like 90. Out of control. On just, uh, just yeah. undiluted racism. Yeah. For like Un an yeah. hour yeah. and a half. Yeah. It's inc incredible what he got away with. Yeah. Mm -hmm. wow. But so let's let it play. So he's laughing right here. And also, very tame joke. Mm -hmm. I guess yeah. it was a reference to Demi Moore, who who was in G.I. Jane 1 and had yeah. a shaved head. She's clearly got a fucking shaved head. Well, there's a little bit more to be known. She has alopecia. I She's saw, losing I, her hair. I know. Ooh, I, I heard okay. about that. And, oh, I didn't know that. Uh, cry me a fucking river. Yeah, guys <laughs> lose their hair all the time. I, I, read, her, true, true. I read her statements on it. J what's her name? Jada Pinkett Smith. Jada. What, I read Jada's, Jada's yeah. statements on her hair loss, and she's acting like she lost her firstborn child. Just, uh, it's, sometimes you think that the world is so cruel, and I didn't know how to cope with it. I didn't come out of my house for 13 days, and I cried, and I saw my therapist, and I just had to turn my life over to Jesus. It, it actually reads like that. The, the fucking narcissism of these celebrities to think anybody cares. Yeah. Like like you yeah. said, guys go bald all oh, the time. Yeah, most men. Fuck, factory workers lose yeah. their arms. I'm going to be honest with you. Black girls also wear weaves like all the time. Yeah. Front, Danny, if me and you were this front. big, though, we'd fucking be out of our minds, though. Are you kidding me? <laughs> We'd show up to the Academy Awards wearing something out of control. If we were the, if we got invited there, yeah. do you know what we would be like there? Yeah. We we're talking shit about them. Yeah, we would have been out of control, dude. If I got invited to this, which it would never <laughs> yeah. happen. Who but knows? We'd go up to that fur shop in Alaska, mm -hmm. and we'd be in head to toe furs, <laughs> leopards, dude. Fur we socks. Like four dead leopards yes. on each of us. And Eight then, dead leopards between us. And then I would have a leopard cub mm -hmm. that I would sacrifice on stage. <laughs> To a Norse god. 
<laughs> and never get invited back. But we'd fucking we'd be we'd be laughing our way. We'd be getting pizza and limo afterward. So let's let it play. So first of all, Will Smith here is laughing, which makes me think he missed his cue. Yeah. I think whatever Hollywood producer type was probably in his ear right here like, no, beat, you're supposed to be mad, asshole. Yeah. There's going to be no continuity between this and the slap. It's not working. Hey, so let's let it play. Because eventually he does start talking smack from his yeah. seat, right? Yeah. yeah. Let's go. That's actually pretty funny. <laughs> That's true. I can see that happening. <laughs> and then he's waiting yes, a little too long a, on it. That was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. <laughs> he just gets up. He says, let's hear it. Oh, Wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. <laughs> Nick, that was funny. Out your fucking mouth. Wow, dude. Yes. It was a G.I. Jane jump. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. I'm going to, okay? <laughs> I can, oh, okay. That was a... Uh, Greatest really night in the history of television. Okay. <laughs> He's a good okay. actor, Will Smith, man, if that's acting. I Repl think it's real. Replay personally. it. See, yeah, I didn't see that. I didn't see that. I only saw the smack. Let's watch the smack one more time. It's really loud. Chris seems to be leaning into I'm it. I'm out here. Well, Chris says, let's hear it. So he uh, he thinks that Will Ooh. is going to come and say something into his microphone. Sure. Ooh, oh, that's, yeah, that, the, the let's hear it is weird. <laughs> Oh, wow. Was that closed fist? Wow. No, it's, no, it's open. open. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Oh, my God. Keep my oh. name out your fucking mouth. Wow, dude. Yes. It was a G.I. Jane jump. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. I'm going to, okay? Press pause. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Either he's committed. Look, there is. I'm going to be honest. As an actor that has seen some high level theater acting, for example, if you really study uh, like for a long time, you can convince yourself to be that mad and even have like the the little tears welling up. Like he could pull that off. Mm -hmm. He would, could pull that off. Would they tell them to, to curse on live television? That's like <laughs> a big probably. No -no. Probably. Uh, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking if it was staged, he wouldn't have dropped an f bomb. Mm -hmm. and also, I, I feel like they I feel like they would have given him something a little snappier too. like you disrespect my woman. You disrespect me. Yeah. Just something uh, a little I'd, bit more. Yeah. I, think Whereas, they, I think they gave him the improv. They go, you know, you you riff that Will Smith. Maybe. You don't think they I think they yeah. were like, you're good. They trust him. if you're going to do it. Will Smith, just riff it. You're good. It's just like he's lost all right to walk up and smack a dude over insulting his wife. He yeah. lost all right to do that when his wife like publicly admitted yeah. to banging some C-level rapper. And, uh, and multiple then told times. him to his face that like it doesn't matter. And right. that she did yeah. it for like her mental health. And he's yeah. just sitting there like, Ugh. oh my God. And they've been yeah. married for super long. You mm -hmm. can't just do that yeah. like 14 years into a marriage. And he's single, Chris Rock now. Is he? I'm pretty sure he's single, yeah. Chris Rock be getting some fucking pussy. So there was a, okay, you know how Black Twitter's obviously going off with this? Yeah, yeah. Dude, one of my, Black Twitter? Yeah. Is that a new app? No, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's the, the bird it's is just the darker Twitter, in pigmentation. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Twitter that, uh, that is in uh, the black uh, community. You, you're talking about Africans on, African Americans on Twitter. Africans do, yeah, sure. Yeah, I, African American isn't politically correct anymore, is it? Is I think, it? I think black is the new politically correct term. So Black Twitter, we need to, mm -hmm. we need to take yeah. off isn't of Black Twitter. Isn't that weird how it, they wanted us to say African American because that was more politically correct. Mm -hmm. But now, when you read the LA Times, it seems like black with a capital B is the accepted way to refer to black people. Well, also, like, not everybody is oh, an good. American. So yeah. often right. you'll have True. people call, like, they're trying to be progressive and they'll call, like, a British black guy an African American. Yeah, and they'll yeah. be like, bro, I'm not American. Uh, I'm just black. <laughs> I'm going to pose this question to, to King Croc. Yeah. If a man slapped you in front of Zendaya and Zoe Kravitz. Those Lenny's daughters? No, the one is Lenny's daughter. Who's okay. okay, basically the two hottest women in Hollywood right now by far are they're half black. Can you pull other. them up? They're incredibly beautiful. Anyway, uh Shanning's date, dating one of them. Anyway. Channing Tatum? Shanning Tatum, yeah. Now mm. now this got like this tweet got like a massive amount of likes. Apparently. Yeah. So if somebody slapped you, King Croc, in front yeah. of Zendaya and Zoe Kravitz, what what what's happening? 
me personally, I have to throw hands. Yeah, you got to throw. You got to fight. If I'm getting my ass. See, beat, see what I'm saying? Clear. Yeah, but what I mean, what if they're just at a nearby cafe and they see it? Well, it doesn't matter, Dandy. If Zendaya and Zoe Kravitz, that's Zendaya, oh. she's gorgeous. Now we go Zoe Kravitz, uh, who's Zendaya is like young. I'm but. holding out more hope for Zoe. You, you got to see the rest of it, man. Go to her Instagram. I feel like why are we on? I her? want to get away. Zoe Kravitz, there. She's I there. I want to fly. It was taking me a second to think of a Lenny Kravitz song. Let's see this broad. Who's good? She's got short what hair. Right now. She's about, got dude. short hair right now. She's hot as fuck, dude. She's, Look at her. Hot, she's hotter than the other chick. Zendaya's hot as fuck, dude. The uh, short hair thing is whack. Hot. Your fans are gonna be like, dude. I'm I'm pretty sure the fans agree with me. Zend dude, what do you think about Zendaya and Zoe Kravitz? Pretty good looking. They're she's hot. Good looking. Yeah, she's also hot. the best actresses per for per, per level of hotness. You know what I mean? Like they're the hottest best actresses uh -huh, right now. Because the best actresses aren't hot. They're probably yeah. Who's like the Meryl best Street, actress? Meryl Streep. She's pretty cute. I mean, back in the day, she was all right. Who's the best actress under 35? Best actress under 35? I say I'd let, let's go for best actress uh, under that looks Mia under 35. That's King uh, Rock. No, I was going to say Mia Khalifa. But oh. she's not an actress. <laughs> hey, best actress of that sorts? looks under 35 because I think she's over 35 is. Uh, um, God damn it. The redhead. What's her fucking name? Emma Stone. No. I mean, I like yeah, actually, Stone. you could say she's Emma Stone. Not, yeah, Emma Stone's Jennifer, actually Jennifer Lawrence. No, Jennifer, Jennifer Lawrence, Lawrence. Actually, yeah, she's thirty. She's pretty hot. She's pretty. Is she a good she's actress. Just, she's, she's phenomenal. Mm -hmm. She has an Academy she's Award. Really good, yeah. mm -hmm. She has an Academy Award.